Right, James, well, Mike, uh, interesting game today. Ended up uh, quite split, quite entertaining in that second half, but uh, both teams had to go. Yeah, you know, I'll probably reflect the things, you know, the draw, probably the right results, you know. They're a good team, they're on a good run, and, you know, we weren't on a good run, so, you know, to, to take a draw, you know, it's not the end of the world, it's a, it, it's a decent point and it's a clean sheet, and so it's, you know, something for us to build on from here on out. Yeah, how important is that? I mean, off the back of you know, four successive defeats, you sort of, you know, a win over an on-league side in the FA Cup and then, and then a draw away and a draw at home, I guess yeah. you're not, not saying great for the small comforts, but you kind of look to take the positives you can. Yeah, of course. You know, after a bad run, you, you know, you're not just going to go on a run where you, you win four on the five on the balance. You know, we've got three unbeaten basically now. You know, we won the FA Cup game, we pointed away last week and a point at home. So you know, we're building it back up, and then <coughs> hopefully, then wins will come and we can go on a good win and run there. So, but it's also not only one goal in the last six, and, and today you had chances. I mean, Jamie had a header, was narrowly off target. Your approach play was generally good. Are you just not getting the bits of luck, or was there something else? Yeah, maybe. Yeah, you know. Obviously, we've conceded a lot of goals sometimes at top, and then today we haven't scored. So, you know, it's, it's mixed and matching a bit. And but you know, a clean sheet was you know a big positive today. And you know, as you said, you know, we had a couple of chances and we could have nicked it. And you know, they could maybe argue they could have nicked it. But you know, a draw was you know a decent enough result for us at the moment. And we something for us to build on. And because you're having a Tuesday, so when you got back to at home games like this, does that put any pressure on you to win the second one? Uh, I would say pressure, but you know, every home game you want to win, so it, it's not come to Tuesday there's any pressure on winning Tuesday. You know, We wanted to win today and come to Tuesday we'll be what maximum points out of Tuesday. So, um, you know, hopefully we can, as we said, you know, three unbeaten, two draws in the league now. Hopefully we want to kick. I think the lads will look forward to Tuesday now and you know, the confidence is coming back to us all. Obviously a tough league, isn't it? I mean, there's some strange results every week, but on, on the whole, it's a bit of a match and match, it's almost from top to bottom. Yeah, you know, it, 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 I've said since the start, it, it's a very tough league this year, and you know, there's a lot of good teams. You know, you look at them today; they, they've been on a good run, and they're a very good team. You know, they, they like to play, and so no games are easy in this league this year, definitely not. So, you know, every game you, know, you need to make sure you're right up for it, and you know, any win in this league is, is good against anyone. So, hopefully, Tuesday will be a tough game against Swindon. You know, they're a good team; they like to play similar today, and hopefully, we can get the win this time. Yeah, because they just now they missed that last year, got to the playoffs and lost to, to Brentford. Um, yeah. And they're challenging again this year. Yeah, they are. You know, they're a good team. Um, said they, they do like to play. Um, so that'll be a tough game for us. You know, but we'll be up for it and we'll be hoping for maximum points out of it. But your own role in the team, you've set down this central midfield position. I know when we spoke last season, you yeah. said you'd, you'd like to play there and you could start to play there towards the end of the season. Must be well played. Yeah, you know, yeah, I've always kind of played it more centrally, so, you know, I've. I'm enjoying it there this year, and you know some good competition. You know, we've got Nick Danny. You know, we've got Josh. You know, on the base tonight, you can play in there. Um, but yeah, I'm enjoying it. So but I know I've got to keep the form to keep my place. So yeah, I'm enjoying it. Do you, do you like playing in that too, in, in front of the defence, eh, from you know, protecting the back four? But also, you seem to take the ball off the defenders and uh, yeah. get things going. Yeah, you know, I quite like it. I like, you know, I like getting on the ball. So you know, it's nice to get the ball back four and you know get us ticking, get us playing. And that's what I enjoy. And obviously the. The other side, the dog side, you know, I don't mind, it's got to be done. Especially when you play centrally, you know, you can't, can't shy away from tackles or going back to your own goal, it's got to be done. So, yeah, I enjoyed it in there. Yeah, so hopefully I'll keep my place and keep going. Of course, mentioned Manny play alongside Danny Baldwin. I mean, he's not been any younger, but it seems like he still have terrific work, right? Yeah. still plenty in the tank. God, yeah, you, <coughs> you see him moving about, you think he's still 21, wouldn't you? No, he gets about the pitch great, Dan, and he's, he's, he's a great one to have in there, especially with his experience. So, yeah, I enjoy playing in there with him. You know, he's, you know, he's obviously had a really good career and, as you said, the way he still moves about the pitch, you wouldn't think he's the age he is, so that's good. I'm fair to say maybe that you, you've had a bit of harsh criticism last season because it took, maybe took you a while to settle in, but do you feel now you're sort of showing people what you're capable of? Yeah, hopefully, yeah. You know, I've, I let other people do talk about I don't, I don't, to be honest, I don't listen to other people. You know, I try and, before I know when I've, I've not played well or I've played well, so, you know, I just try and do best as I can for Crowley Town on a Saturday or Tuesday and work hard, that's what I always do and hopefully the rest will take care of itself.